When the rain hits my window, I take it <laughs> Me some, me and Timberland We sang a dangle We so tight that you get our styles tangled Yeah, I took a lot of time So she don't like you loco Can we get pink at night like Coco? But you're cool, cool like Principe sa sirkita Can we get pink at night like Coco? Can we get pink at night like Coco? Like, like Coco? call her the big mouth actress because mainly I forget her name is Julia Robert I have no clue why, we, why would she be so famous and why would anybody believe that she would be the best or highest paid actress on earth huh? I call her I named her myself the big mouth actress because that's all she's got there's nothing else going on she has no brains she has no heart she is vulgar she doesn't know how to walk but you like them because they are carefree they don't bleed they don't think they have no considerations and she most definitely has no concern or regard for anybody but herself. Too short of stopping the video right here, ask me about someone else. I like Michelle Pfeiffer. She's got a lot of things going on. And I like a lot of other actresses which have like secondary roles or, or so. I said it a few weeks ago, I have not looked up any names, I can give them to you. But mainly they are smart or they are sweet or both. And Michelle Pfeiffer is pretty, she is beautiful, but she also has pep in her, pep in her, <laughs> in her butt, that's how we say it. And she's got intellect going on for herself as well. Who is smarter and brighter, Bruce Willis or Michelle Pfeiffer? How could you put them on a list? Michelle Pfeiffer is smart and Bruce Willis is not. But he is likable because he always smiles. A weird little smile, a smirk smile. Smirk in his mouth and smile in his eyes. These are all sur unrealistic people, not even surrealistic, just not realistic. Actors, actresses, that's fine. They represent certain status of something. A status, a state of... Uh, <laughs> you want me to look? Okay. Um, yeah, yeah, they could maybe represent an adjective. One adjective. I am listening. I'm working my ass if I know that. You don't want to know how I feel. You do not. So yes, I am not complacent. I'm never complacent. Because complacency doesn't feel right. So I don't like it. I like to feel right. I know, I'm constantly moving stuff around. When am I allowed to move? <laughs> Cleaning, rearranging. I am super sad right now. I'm working it really hard, really much to feel better. But you don't want to hear that. You want me to talk about, I don't know, actresses, actors. <laughs> Well, I'm sorry. I'm recording a mute, muteness, muteness. I know, despite and regardless what anybody does to me, you cannot take my love away. 
ever. When my heart does not harden. Ever. Can you see the birds? That's all I can zoom in. Can you hear the bird? Oh, it's still doing. I was distracted a little bit, so I paused the movie to record the birdie. Can you hear the little noise it makes? At first I thought it was maybe a hummingbird because of the noise. And then I localized him it was all the way next to the wall. <laughs> yeah, well, I am fascinated with a lot of nice things of nature. It's just who I am. Okay. Oh, yeah.